In eBook Central, it is possible to save and print part of an eBook. How much depends on the size of the book. Firstly, sign into eBook Central. If you haven't already created an account, and follow the prompts. Open the details page for the eBook you wish to save content from. Under Available for Online Reading, eBook Central advises how many pages are available for copying and how many for print. Copying allows you to select a portion of text and then paste it into another document. The print limit indicates the maximum number of pages that can be saved to a PDF. The amount available will vary for each book, as it is a percentage of the total number of pages. Click on the Available for Online Reading link. Chapter Download and Print to PDF give you the same options for saving a chapter or section of the ebook in a PDF format. A prompt to sign in will come up if you haven't signed in yet. If the chapter is longer than the page limit, then you will be prompted to select a page range. Choosing the citation format will change the reference provided at the bottom of the first page. Remember that this is a machine-generated reference and still needs to be checked before using in an assignment. Clicking Continue creates the file. Click this button. Your file will be downloaded to your computer. Once the PDF file is created, you can read or print that file any time. It doesn't expire. Right-click to save as and save it on your computer or device, or click the Download button if in Chrome. If you don't select anywhere to save it, the default location is your Downloads folder. Note the reference at the bottom of the first page. Copying works by selecting the Copy button. If nothing is pre-selected, then the text on the whole page is copied. The other way is to select the text first and then click the Copy button. From the pop-up window, use Ctrl C to copy the text, which you can then paste into any document. Remember that this is for the purposes of reading offline. Pasting an extract straight into an assignment is plagiarism if it is not referenced. We recommend you watch these videos. For more assistance, please contact the library.